guys, I'm Kelly. I am a certified health coach and life coach. And I'm here today to talk to you about brain fog, okay? So we all deal with brain fog at one point in our lives or another, but brain fog can be a major dampener on our quality of life. How to address it, how to deal with it when brain fog comes up, because there's definitely some good strategies you can put into place to deal with brain fog. Things that you can do and start looking at. First, I wanna tell you, when it comes to your health, the number one thing is to hurt yourself without judgment. So if you're one of those people who really beats up on yourself, follow something or a plan that you wanted to do, I'm just going to ask you to release that. We are going to take a look at ourselves and at our stress levels and things like that. And the best way to approach that is a, from a place of non-judgment. So what I mean by that is as you watch this video or other videos, if something comes up for you, if you feel like, wow, I really shouldn't be doing that, or I know I'm doing that and I really shouldn't be. So instead of beating yourself up, I want you to take the approach where you're actually observing, okay, your pattern. Because all we can do is observe our pattern and then change it tomorrow, today. Put it into action as soon as we know better. And there is a lot of self-love that goes into that process. So I just want to encourage you with that because it's really easy to listen to advice from people or to understand things about health and to beat ourselves up. I am a person who really has high expectations for myself, so I know firsthand how toxic it can be and how much we need to give ourselves grace in the process and love ourselves because that is what is going to create lasting change. So on to brain fog. The number one thing I would say about brain fog is that you need to look at your sugar consumption throughout the day. And when I say sugar, I mean not just like guzzling down white sugar, something like that. I just mean, what types of foods are you eating? Are you eating mostly whole foods from the earth? So like apples, oranges, bananas. Yes, those things have sugar. Yes, but there are different types of sugar and your body handles them in a different way. White refined sugar can contribute to brain fog. So that is definitely something you wanna take a look at and see if you have that, a lot of that, in your current eating habits. If you do, it's okay. Just approach the next time you go to the store with an eye of looking for those added ingredients. Try to shop for more whole foods. And when you do that, you'll start noticing other changes as well. Your body will start craving different foods. And that is when you know you're starting to heal your body from the inside out. And that's such a beautiful thing when you get there. So I'm looking forward to hearing about that from you. And then the next thing that I would say about brain fog, you really want to take a look at your stress level. If you're very stressed, if you're always feeling like weighed down and bogged down, even in our current situation with the way things are going and the pace of life is a lot slower, we can still feed our minds with things that are very toxic. The thing that I would say about that for you is to take some time to meditate every day. When I first heard about meditation, I thought, that's not for me. I don't have time for that. Wow, was I wrong, okay? Meditation is one of those things that can actually multiply your time. It can shift your perspective. It can change your stress level throughout the day. First time you do it, it's probably going to feel awkward. It might feel a little bit weird. It's okay because as time goes on and you learn to meditate, you'll start to notice mindfulness kicking in for you and you'll start to feel a lot better and to approach situations in your life with different perspectives. So that is definitely something 
that you should check out and start adding into your daily routine. If you don't already have a morning routine, that's something that I highly suggest you create, and it can be perfectly tailored to you. So it doesn't have to look like anybody else's morning routine. It can be as simple as wake up, meditate, have coffee. There's a morning routine. So easy, right? The next thing that you might want to do is to look into CBD oil. What CBD oil can do is help lower stress and anxiety in your life. And these things are things that can start leading to brain fog as well. So CBD oil has many, many benefits, but one of those is it can help your brain kind of notch down. If you're used to a very high level of stress, sometimes you need something to help you just recenter and re-calm yourself. And that is a really great thing to start looking into. So those are a few ideas for you to think about eliminating brain fog and to look clarity and perspective. I really hope that these things were helpful for you. I would love to know what you thought. Love to know what you thought. Take the time to subscribe and I will send you a notification every time I post a new video. And I have a lot of great content planned over the next few months. So I can't wait to continue sharing with you and to hear from you on what is helpful for you and what you would like to learn about. Please comment below. Let me know where you're from and what you thought about this video. Can't wait to talk soon.